Today, we're diving deep into the latest drop that's got everyone talking, Gunna's new album. From the moment the first beat hits, you know this isn't just any release. This album comes on the back of quite a tumultuous year for Gunna, marred with controversies and beefs that seem to only fuel his creative fires rather than smother them. Let's start with the background, setting the scene for this explosive release. Just last week, Future, a well-known figure in the rap scene, threw what many perceived as shade towards Gunna, dropping hints of a new mixtape that directly competes with Gunna's release schedule and not shying away from calling out unnamed rivals. This scenario isn't just about music. It's about loyalty, rivalry, and street cred. Gunna brings in heavy hitters, strategic alliances that not only enhance the album's appeal, but send clear signals to his detractors. Collaborations in this album aren't just for show, they're for telling a cohesive story, a narrative built around unity, strength, and perhaps redemption. It's clear Gunna is not only addressing his current critics, but also setting the stage for his future in the industry. He's not just defending his choices, he's proclaiming his legacy. And that brings us to why this album is not just a collection of tracks, but a landmark in Gunna's career. Every beat, every lyric, and every collaboration in this album tells a part of a larger story that Gunna is writing in real time. Despite this praise for Gunna's upcoming album, Future previously appeared to throw shade at Gunna earlier this year, presumably due to his relationship with Young Thug, who Gunna has been accused of snitching on. Back in March, Pluto's X page posted a link to Gunna's music video for Prada Dim featuring Offset before deleting it hours later. The free band's boss then posted a snippet of Type Shit, his collaboration with Travis Scott and Playboy Cardi from his and Metro Boomin's We Don't Trust You album, which includes the lyrics, I don't hang with rats, that's some new type shit. Get a nigga whacked on the news type shit. Both moves were seen as digs at Gunna, who controversially accepted a plea deal in the ongoing YSL Rico case, which Thug is still on trial for. If you enjoyed this deep dive into Gunna's latest album and want more content like this, don't forget to hit that subscribe button. Like this video? Leave a comment with your thoughts and turn on post notifications so you never miss out on future uploads. Your support helps us bring more such detailed reviews.